A new study revealing one third of union households would opt out of their union if they were given a chance. Joining us now is Victor Jokes. He's executive director of National Employee Freedom Week. Victor, one third, that's a, a pretty shocking number. How, how'd you come up with that? Well, it is. It's, it's really a staggering amount. And what we did is we did a survey of union households across the country uh, asking that question. If it were possible to opt out of your union membership without losing your job or any other penalty, uh, would you do so? And a third of union members across the nation said they would. And in some states, like California, it was even higher, 36 percent. So there is a significant portion of union members across the country who want to leave. And National Employee Freedom Week is dedicated to letting them know what they're Options are and that they can. Well, what, what do you, what, what's their biggest beef? Why do they want to get out of the unions when the unions say, hey, if it wasn't for us, you wouldn't have these amazing salaries, these amazing vacation days, you wouldn't be able to retire early. So, what's the pushback? Well, th there's lots of different reasons. We find that every employee's story is unique. Uh, some are just sick of union bosses making hundreds of thousands of dollars a year off of their dues. Uh, others think that, you know, I can spend my thousand dollars in dues better than they can. Uh, others find uh, better non-union alternatives, like for teachers, the Association of American Educators offers a, a better liability uh, insurance policy, better legal coverage for a fraction of, of the price. So there's not one hard and fast rule. Some have objections to uh, the union's political leanings or their support of uh, leftist social causes. But right. every uh, union employee's reason is unique for leaving. Well, I got to tell you, Victor, uh, this is something we talk about a lot of Varney and Company. And uh, it's, it's great to see someone out there actually pushing back. So we're going to come back to you from time to time to get a pulse on this and just to see how well it's going for you. We'll talk to you again real soon. I look forward to it. Thank okay. you.